Good afternoon. I'm Shelly Aragon with MMA Monday, standing here with Paul Mundello. Hello, Paul. Good. How are you Thanks doing? Thanks for interviewing with us. No problem at all. We'll keep it short and sweet because we know you have a busy week ahead of you. And uh, how long have you been here in Denver? I've been here for uh, six weeks now. So, yeah, pretty much on six weeks. Uh, came in the first week of February and just been here ever since. And tell us, does the uh, altitude make a difference for you? The first week, the first week was when I was here, the altitude made a big difference. And luckily that I had good trainers, you know, like Trevor and, and Van Arsdale, they slowly just incremented the workouts, and I think that really helped me on the, getting acclimated. Absolutely. And you're fighting at Czech Congo this weekend? Fighting Czech Congo, uh, pretty much Sunday, and it's on, you know, it's six, he's 6'4", six, 240 pounds, and, you know, he's known for a big kickboxer, he's just got to work what we've been working on, and, and just get the win. Absolutely. We all look forward to that as well. Yeah. Any thoughts on the uh, main events? Uh, not too much. You know, it's going to be interesting to watch uh, Gonzaga and uh, Dos Santos. And, you know, John Jones and Vera. Vera's always exciting to watch, even John Jones. But the whole thing is I'm just focusing on my fight. Absolutely. And uh, get ready for that. I always have to ask people because I was looking at your stuff and uh, the headhunter, that just sounds scary. <laughs> where, did, where did that nickname <laughs> yeah, come about? That thing's been around me for, you know, back in Taekwondo, back in high school days when I should have went to the body or I should have kicked the legs or kicked the thighs. And I was actually, you know, going for the head, going for the you know, three-point kicks. And my trainer at the time was like, you know, don't quit head hunting, quit head hunting. You know, you're just going to lose tournaments and stuff like that. And the name stuck. Okay, so that's where it comes from. Yeah. All right, yeah. It, it, it's funny because it's a hard name to stick by. I can't go out there and take the guy down or, or go for submissions and stuff. It's a hard name to live by. Is it? Yeah. Okay. I, I like it though, head hunter. I mean, like I said, I saw that. And I was like, wow, that just sounds scary. I was almost <laughs> afraid to interview with you just now. So thanks for being so kind. Oh no, <laughs> I'll only get mean on, on certain days. Absolutely. Like March 21st, right on the corner. It's a, it's a set date. Gotta get angry. We're looking forward to that date. We can't wait to uh, see it. UFC on Versus here in Denver, or Broomfield, Colorado, Broomfield. I guess. So, Pretty um, much Denver. I think Broomfield's a little bit higher than Denver, so you know, Czech Congo has to get you ready for the altitude. Absolutely, and uh, from there, you're going back to Texas? I go back to Texas and relax. I think I might go back there, go to Arizona if Mike Benard, though, is set up some extra, some post-workout training after the uh, fight to uh, just keep the cardio going. Well, best of luck for you, uh, to you, and we look forward to seeing you on Sunday. Right, Thank thanks. you.